he is indeed going against Ryan LV, the reigning champ of whatever Marvel tournament that's happened in the past, you know, year. Yeah, I've been. Or so. When you when you mention it, I've been thinking like, what would you do against Ryan? Because the messed up part about his team is, if you try to run away from him, he's gonna build meter. But if you try to chase him down, you're gonna run into something eventually. So it's kind of like a lose lose situation. It's yeah, I mean, very tough. Yeah, that, I think that's why he's so good, right? Is that like he has this he has his team constructed where he can play any style, he can mm -hmm. adapt to any type of opponent or any type of team. And either way, it'll be effective. I think on top of him just being an incredible player and very on top of his game right now, I think the way he's constructed his team and the way he plays it is just a very top notch. So we're going to get into a bunch. Checks are over, or maybe not. We're going to get controller operation mode, make sure the auto jump is off. That was one of my pet peeves whenever I played this game. Oh, yeah, and by the way, if you guys, if you sponsors out there haven't noticed, Ryan LV is uh, going lone wolf at the moment. Yeah, and, man. And if you want to get a good pickup, you're looking at the best player, potentially the best player right now in Marvel 3. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Here we go. If you weren't sleeping, you would already have some trophies in your room, you know what I'm saying? Ooh. Ryan LV already picking him up off the air throw. Let's get the OTG. Oh. SBK, Ryan to the Morgan. Are we going to get the infinite? Oh, yeah. Ryan LV so smooth with these all day. So optimized. I mean... A lot of the stuff he's doing, the Morgan is like, eh, we thought it was kind of too hard, too difficult. But Ryan LV is just like, hey, I have these in the corner and mid screen. Yeah, you know, big shots to, to Helix back in the day. He was definitely one yeah. of those guys that put in the Morgan infinites and work. And Ryan LV showing that, man, this is viable at every level, including the highest. Well, zero is down, five bars on deck. Man, let's go into Astral Vision because we're building that fifth meter easy. Yeah, and you were saying before that his that team is so flexible. Even though he had the bar, he's off. He's able to spend Man, the bar Andy with Morgan. That, yeah, I have to interrupt real quick because those were some impressive blocks. Even yeah. though Andy G is dead again and this Dante is over, those were really impressive blocks. I'm sorry. Cool. Nice. Okay, here we go. We get the play. It's a matter of whether he can get to Phoenix in time with X Factor. Yeah, that is very true. Is he? I wonder if he. Nah, just take out this Morgan. Yeah. I said, where if he's even going to snap? I mean, she has five bars already, so might as well take out this Chun Li and this Morgan first. Now he needs to hit right now. If he doesn't, then it's going to be looking like a difficult battle for Andy G. Yeah, and immediately after blocking the round trip, just manages to air dash out, give him some space back. Oh, yeah. No X Factor. I'm surprised. And it might come back to hurt him. Phoenix gets pop. Andy has bar. Yeah, he's got a lot of bar. Someone swords on deck. Ooh, just clips her. Andy oh, and gets, gets the it. Hit. First game. Andy G brings it back with the Lord of Light. My man, Virgil. Andy G, he's mostly focusing on Street Fighter V now, but <laughs> taking one game off of the best player. The best already. Is this, is this the, the max commentator's curse? Oh, no, not looking so far. Uh-oh. Chun Li. I mean, looking this like the same exact scenario as last game. Right, that's true, though. Charged up SBK. Oh, goes, goes for the, the reset. reset. Yeah. Andy G being very disciplined, though, just blocks it. We'll try to cross up, but Jam Session came out a little too far forward. Ryan LV just managed to recover in front of it. Oh, taking to the sky with the legs. It's gonna build that meter. Jockeying for neutral advantage. Oh, gets the conversion. Yeah. Okay. Even though Ryan LV does have five bars, Andy G, he's starting to the zero momentum. This is really, really important. So he's gonna kill Chun Li, obviously. Now it's whether when Morgan comes in, if he's gonna kill her or snap to fight a potentially level two Phoenix. Yeah, that's what I want to see as well. We get the whole jam session pressure, gets the lightning as well. Not really much of a mix up, but he's making sure Ryan LV is locked down and he finds the hit on Morgan. Oh no, he missed the wow. dive. We'll try for the crossover. Ooh, Morgan with the big buttons coming down, manages to clip him. Nice, nullifying the fireball, but it, a second one was coming. Oh, he didn't nullify the fireball, it was only one hit. Ooh. Wow, it looks so good for Andy G for a moment. Ooh, good oh. chicken block on the wake up, but wasn't expecting Phoenix to close the gap that quickly. Cool. Bring him down. X Factor. We're just going to use the infinite. Not going to waste that super just in case Virgil goes off. We're going to get the mix up though. Box. This is a good look for Andy G. Goes to the swords. If you can clip her now, can't get the quad combo from there though. Ryan's X Factor is almost out. Andy G still pretty healthy with the red. 
Yeah, you're going to see Ryan just try to stick in the air as long as possible. And he actually raw tags in Morgan. Going to sacrifice her to the Lord. That might not be good. Cool. Yeah, going to go into some sorts again. Oh. Hawks, good push block, trying to get that space back. Good job adjusting there. Does get clipped anyway. Doesn't have the meter to convert for the infinite. That was combos. sick. I've never seen that variation before. I'll tell you, man, Ryan LV has so many things. I remember somebody asked him what the best Morgan assist was, and he was says Phoenix Fireball. Cool. <laughs> That's how you know this man knows his team. Wow. And the you know what? Phoenix. He, Ryan LV had five bars, decided to tag in Phoenix anyways, and didn't even need the dark, nah. dark one. Straight up default Jean Grey. And arguably, she's one of the best characters by, her, by herself, but because we see Dark Phoenix so often, we, she's often overlooked. Yeah. She is a great character. And here we go. Andy. In the th first hit. Yeah, advantageous. We yeah, we scale from the jam session. Doesn't matter because we're going straight into the lightning loops. The 9 to 5. We do these all day, every day. Can't be dropping them in 2017, and Andy G knows this. Gets the hit. No conversion. Snap. Ooh. There we go. Oh, that kind of messed it up mid-screen. Yeah, yeah he didn't expect corner. that. Oh, going to build some bar with the Morgan assist now. And, yeah, you see how like, unafraid he is to just go in with Phoenix. Gets the X Factor on the cross-up. Let's go. Just a, a tip for you guys. Don't push block the Phoenix, uh, Phoenix DP, uh, Phoenix Cycle Crusher, because yeah. you can grab it if she misses. Misplaces it. Oh man, the easy two mix ups from Ryan LV right into the infinites. X Factor is gone. He's going to have to deal with Virgil, oh. but that was a sick cross up. Is he going to look for the TAC to Morgan? Or oh, I think it's super into level yeah, three? Yeah, super level three for sure. Warren oh. coming in. Big damage with the level three. He's going up 2 1 on Andy G. Doesn't even get a chance to pop that X Factor. Lure of Light. Is kept in the darkness. But Andy G is not looking too bad, actually. He's been fighting Ryan LV relatively well. He's been getting a lot of the hits he needs, but it's when, Fe when Naked Phoenix comes in by herself, she just kind of wrecks shop without the dark yeah, one. Man. Oh. oh, no, Aaron Fireball. Andy G catches it. The Buster after the Lightning. Let's go back to work. Lightning loops on deck. Easy stuff. What's gonna be? The oh no! Not the easy stuff. Wow! Actually, gets the snap conversion. Yes, he does. Does he have the buster? Oh, yes, nice. he does. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Knew he was gonna get the hard knockdown. He caught her in the air. Good adjustment. And he's gonna go into this again. We'll make sure she's dead. Probably could have finished it off with the DP, but better safe than sorry. Gonna use the level three to get out of the situation. This is Andy just G's best chance to tie it up two-two. Winner side. Cool. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh, he let the level one buster go and then came down. I thought he clicked Morgan, but the Chun Li assist even was there. Just shows you how good Ryan LB is at using all his uh, tools. And he gets the down TAC into Chun Li. Oh, no, no, drops it. He never drops those. Oh, man. <laughs> A couple of crowd members yell out PS4, but that has no excuse, my friend. You guys know this coming in. Tournament standard at this point. Cool. Trying to open him up. Oh, I can't just block stayed forever. on the same no. side. And this could go to the last game. But what? Andy drops the combo, gets the cross up anyway. Gets the American reset. Can we convert this one, please? Oh, yeah. No! Whoa! All right. All right. And I just peeked over at Andy G's. <laughs> and he's scratching his head because he knew he, he had the game two times already. And Morgan as level three. He's She's not too bad. No, definitely not. Especially Rhino V, right? He's so adept at playing all his characters on point so well. Oh, goes into the Astral Vision. He's still waiting for the X Factor 2. I really like these fireball loops from uh, Rhino V. Like these patterns. He's always smart about which patterns to go into. Oh, oh all right. okay. All right. Two, two. I must say, that was way simpler than I thought. <laughs> yes. X Factor H. <laughs> Let's go. The two. classic. Ryan LV. Tied up against Andy G, gets the first hit. This is winner's side. Cool. Looking like the lead combos. Looking like the first two games for Ryan LV. He's getting the first hit, but doesn't matter. Andy G is able to find his way back to win the game.
Yeah, the very first game was like this, right? He got the hit on zero, infinite or all the way to, to five meters, and that's what's going to happen again, but Andy G was able to pull it out. Let's see. He's also still another victory. Oh, the standing low catches him. Standing low and a cross up. It's hard to see. Astro Vision, of course, duality. Drops it. Yeah. Needed to save Dante. I think uh, Virgil, backed oh. up by his brother, is a stronger duo. Uh oh. Yeah, I would agree. Oh, try for the cross up, but she was just too far away to give me a clip by the jam session. Nothing to be found. Chun Lee is always there right now. He picks it up. Has the X Fighter on deck. He has five meters as well. Oh, the reset. We're not TACing you, my friend. Just going to hit you in the mouth. And just like that, Andy G fought valiantly, but Ryan Rovi is looking totally in control. Oh. Oh, yeah, we got the X-Factor and the level three is coming to finish the job. Oh, yeah. Morgan, Ryan LV, 3-2, moving on. Closer than I expected. Big ups to Andy G, making the champ sweat.